What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. Uh, in today's video, we're kind of going to be going over what's going on. I, uh, we just, we're really just waiting on update, updates. We're kind of at a standstill. Uh, Pat is about to go get painted. I'm waiting on fenders and front fascia and stuff like that. But I don't know if you can see over here, Pat is getting a new turbo. The one that's on it is an 80 millimeter VS, just cast, regular, like $600 turbo. Uh, that's a billet center section, triple bearing, 88 millimeter. So I'm going to be putting that on Pat, rerunning the exhaust so it'll fit daily street rules if I want to run daily street classes. And then uh, it might be a little bit hard. I gotta take the exhaust, go down through there. Uh, I'm guessing. Yeah, probably. I'm probably gonna run it down through there. I don't know, it might be a little tough. I gotta redo all my fuel line, order the new intake for it, so new intake's coming, stuff like that. And then after I do all that, Pat's gonna be sent to the paint shop, painted. Uh, take your guesses down below on what colors that I'm thinking about painting Pat. Uh, on the Yeti, it's still waiting to go to the body shop to get this frame horn pulled over. That'll be sometime this next week. Uh, the Dragon is really ready. It's just waiting on a uh, the, us to run the training lines back to a new training cooler that we've mounted. Uh, I got a new daily. I don't know if you can see it. It's an 05 crew cab truck. I got to do a couple things to it. There's a, bo a, a system in it, and the box is just sitting in the back seat. But uh, it'll be the new daily tow truck. Uh, and then really on the black truck, it's just kind of sitting there. I thought about putting this the 80 millimeter off the pad on it, but let me know down let me know down in the comments if that's something you'd like to see either that or sell that 80 millimeter and try to maybe twin turbo it for the least amount of money I can. Uh, so I don't know, but really I'm just gonna be taking the turbo off and hope maybe putting that new one on, getting it all mocked up, and then kind of just looking at the exhaust. But let's get at it. All right, got the exhaust off, intake tube off, all the lines off, nuts off. I don't know Well, that bolt just came out. I don't know how well it's going to be for the other ones, but I'm going to take those out. And we're about to have this turbo off. Got the 80 millimeter out. I don't know if you can tell how much bigger this thing is. But this thing spins like a dream. That one will uh, stop spinning pretty quick, but that one just will keep on going. So, hell yeah. I'm gonna figure out what I need to do to get that thing on. Probably gonna be all winded, because out of shape, having a kid, I've gained a lot of pregnancy weight, you know, it happens. But all right, I'm gonna figure out what I need to do for this. All right, my buddy Jacob came over, helped me get this big old honking turbo on. It took us two days, we were really struggling for a little while, but uh, right now the drain is hitting a plug, uh, hitting a bar that's going across, connecting the fender to the, uh, the rest of the frame. So I'm notching that out right now, and then after that, really all I gotta do is build the five inch exhaust, run it down through there, move all my fuel lines. I'll probably have to move them to the other side. And then uh, I got a new intake coming for it too, so I gotta put that on. And then get the uh, get the cold air pipe all the way connected. And we're done, ready for the paint shop after that. So I don't know if, if we're hanging the fiberglass fenders or what, but say goodbye to the hole. That way, if anybody's riding with me, it doesn't shoot E85 right in their face. I took Jacob for a ride once, and I thought he was going to start crying. So, And he, he, he did cry. He cried. Where is that?
all right guys that'll be it for today's video uh like i said we got the turbo on i'm gonna have to fab up everything and move the fuel lines and stuff like that so that'll be another video i really just wanted to get this one out get some content out uh really like i said we're just waiting on the yeti getting pat ready for the paint shop doing stuff like that so it's gonna be kind of slow on the content stuff for a little while i mean we got the dragon and stuff but once 2021 starts rolling, we're going to hopefully have a lot of racing, a lot of content for you guys. So make sure you like, subscribe, and we'll see you later.